Hi, this is Mike Auerbach. I'm Editor-in-Chief of Pharmaceutical Processing Magazine here at Interfex 2011 at the Facility of the Year Award booth. And I'm speaking with uh, Dave Forney from uh, Shire. His company uh, has won the honorable mention this year in the award program for their Human Genetic Therapies Project Atlas. And uh, Dave, can you tell me about the facility and the, the products you're, you're manufacturing there and the reasons for the facility? Certainly. So. The B400 facility, or the Atlas facility as we call it, is Shire's third mammalian cell culture facility. It's got uh, full capability from upstream cell culture and harvest uh, to downstream purification. We make bulk drug substance at the facility. We're serving the Fabry's patient population uh, with our Replegal product, and we're serving the Gaucher's community with Vipriv, which is a newly licensed product. Um, so the facility is somewhat unique in so much as it is constructed with almost exclusively single-use technology upstream. So from the inoculum train through the bioreactors to harvest, it's all disposable or single-use um, equipment. So that presented some unique challenges with the project, but also uh, provided some opportunities. We did a lot of off-site uh, prep commissioning work and qualification work, and we're really able to bring the process train online at the same time that we were bringing the building out of the ground, where if we had gone with traditional construction methods, the equipment, you know, would have been entering the facility in an untested state, and um, aside from FATs, we would have lost probably six months on the job. So it was uh, a great opportunity, and we worked with some great partners in the, in the equipment and service provider industry. And on that note, I mean, how important to you were the equipment and the service providers to the overall success? Yeah, so they were critical. Um, you know, Shire makes drugs, not facilities and not equipment. So we really look to that community to provide the expertise and complement our in-house knowledge of, uh, of processing and, and manufacturing. So Shire is a little unique in so much as uh, we aspire to be as brave as the people we help. And bravery to us in terms of partnering uh, means really trusting other people to do the right thing. And in the service partner relationship, uh, we really try to make um, opportunities that are mutually beneficial. So, you know, we one of our senior executives characterized Shire as the unpharma. So we try not to be like big pharma. And too many times uh, companies will show up to the table with the kind of been there, done that attitude. And, and Shire's not like that at all. Um, we really look to leverage the knowledge of our service partners, uh, particularly our, our construction and design partners, as well as our equipment vendors. But when we entertain um, when we entertain new ideas or um, new delivery methods, things like that, we're not in the traditional model of pushing that risk down to the service partner, to the, to the constructor, for example. Uh, we want to hold out our opportunities and understand each other's business models so that we can create an environment of mutual trust and transparency, uh, which really enables people to take intelligent risks. And, and that yields benefits for, for you know, both firms. So, um, If you could pick one part of the facility that you're most proud of, what would that be? Of the project or the facility itself? I mean, if it was the project, I'd, I'd certainly say it was our safety record. So um, both Bovis and Shire, Bovis was our construction manager uh, for the B400 project as well as our new office lab project in Lexington. And, um, you know, safety was paramount. Every aspect of planning, uh, every decision we made, every action that's taken, you know, long before people enter the job site, uh, we, we move to mitigate or eliminate safety risks. So we put over 750,000 trade man hours in place on B400 alone, and we had an immaculate safety record. So, um, you know, that doesn't happen by accident. That's very intentional. And it's really our commitment to not just the, the patients we help, but to our employees that, um, you know, makes us hold that as high as we do. And, and it's critically important to us. And just finally, how has the uh, Facility of the Award program been for you so far? Any reactions to that? Oh, yeah. It's, it's been really great. It's been a phenomenal experience. You know, Shire is grateful to ISPE for honoring the project as they have and selecting us for an honorable mention. Um, you know, we enable people with life-altering conditions to lead better lives. That's what we're here to do. And uh, the judges really told us, after reviewing our submission, that that's what came through for them. Uh, was that we live our culture, and it was demonstrated in the way we took risks and you know built the largest single-use cell culture facility in the world at the time. Um, 
It was in the way we partnered with our service providers, as I mentioned. It was in the commitment to the patients and always trying to do the right thing. We brought the job in five months ahead of schedule to put medicine in patients' hands that much sooner. And uh, it was a great project all around. But the, the experience with ISPE and, and the FOIA award has just been outstanding. And we couldn't be more pleased. Really, thank you. Well, thanks for your time and uh, best of luck.